things I think been wrong with this society and with humans in general. I don't think what I think that all these problems comes from what we have as humans. Is that nobody is truly honest? Look to yourself, you always honest, but you ask the truth. Anything? Even if you were scared? In the end, the truth will always be being better. People that feel that some other have lost their trust will always not find in the past and last. And how much you try to hide the truth, it will always come. I know it's sometimes a little bit harsh maybe for you to speak the truth. But that don't mean that you don't have to do it. Yeah. What I want to say, speak always the truth. That makes the world a better place. Imagine that we are a whole world without people that lie, manipulate for wrong personal games. And to only give and that actually give, not live for themselves, but live for others. But the majority of people don't give about what they're happening with yourself, with themselves, but they only give about what uh, what they can give to the world. What I want to say. Then become pretty easily for people to become vegan. Because veganism is about giving back to the planet instead of greed will always take and take and take like the majority of people do. And that's it, and that's also can give somebody else clever real people. Most people do only things for themselves. Maybe you be not the one where I talk about. Maybe Anybody know somebody like, uh, I say just um, a name, that uh, idiot uh, being Cheetah or Shane Dawson that make a lot of uh, videos where he uh, make fun and promotes unhealthy eating on his channel by putting his mouth full with junk food. animal products and various pits, pissy pits and all the other bullshit retards like that sorry that I say retards I don't mean that in our way that's how I call people that don't think for themselves people that's Blindly fall stars well. People that have absolutely no little bit of national intelligence a rational peace begins on the dinner table by what you eat on a daily basis. You don't pray for peace and then do hypocritical violent things. It's not how the world works. Good people oppose discrimination by its roots. Good people don't pay for a rape, torture or murder, no matter to which kind of human being. Universal compassion to all human beings is the only guarantee of morality. It is not your right, based on your traditions, your beliefs and your habits, to deny other living beings their freedom. All living beings, not only humans. Humans be not so special, so godlike or some 
perf so more important that I can actually take without punishment anything from the planet or without retreats for other species. We actually lost. Also, maybe you'll be not told. And where the laws on business of your state don't heal, don't want you to tell. The, species, the laws of species diversity, the laws of dependence on other species, also the world charter for nature. All laws that a lot of you break any day. We'll have more people. Do we have to clear more space and other species so that they can take the biodiversity away from the other species? Because we are, there is a limited amount of resources and a limited amount of space on this planet. That's one of the reasons why logical you can take the life. Uh, the right to procreate from some people away because humans have no national predators anymore and also don't uh, so much die from uh, diseases like uh, and, and all the other diseases where people in the past died from so we can get far easily an overpopulation of humans on the end of the century, we have. I'm going to. out of. Uh, around something like uh, 10 billion humans. That's too much, actually. If we go with this high speed, broken rate like. Uh, rabbits. We have the way to control it. Be rational. Think before you hate commands, do make or something like that. Think what do I say actually. I be just honest. No jokes. No. Man, take a vasectomy. And woman, don't take so much to a uh, man or woman. Adapt. Be so much children that need a home. Leave, uh, need some love from somebody. Why not give them a chance? I mean, a lot of other things uh, humans mean as well, very arrogant. Yeah. Be aware that the reason that we are starving in poor countries is because humans eat in the western countries, meat, dairy, and eggs. Be aware that any two seconds, some children from star from starvation, and that we murder slaughter and torture any year something around hundred fifty one hundred fifty billion animals the meat dairy and egg industry that we that uh, actually been a euphemism before animal holocaust don't feel offended by those words. Holocaust is a holocaust. If you go to the next, to the closest um, meat, dairy, and egg in the uh, slaughterhouses and factory farms, you replace the cows, the chickens, or the turkeys with Jews, you still have a holocaust. 
taken place. The victims being only changed, just only species of victims. They want not to be your victim, just like the, the Jews want to not to be a victim of a Nazi, just like black people want not to be victims of white police, police officers, or vice versa. And the women don't want to be raped, uh, want not to be raped. Children want not to be exploited by their parents as profit. Or their friends that they can say, Oh, look to my children, look what you have done. And this kind of thing. They want to be their self. Want to be. They want to live their life the way they want. If you use the position of the victimizer, all things become justified. And you use mal malice and you use ego. Anything becomes justifiable, but you, when you lose, uh, when you use confession, and you use the victim position, no, one thing will be justified. People awake from your so-called horrific matrix. And look to the world, and look what we do. We steal worm utans from their habitat, and place them in cages, and sell them to rich first world citizens as pets. We have not the right to take the habitat away from the animals. Let's be put the other way around. Want you that some creatures take your habitat away? Still you, home, said that you have to uh, live in a cage. Somebody said that you uh, that you want to Build a new, a new home on your house. And you put you in a prison. I sold you like to prisons and turned the prison in one uh, anti track and went entertainment and say that it is being the prison show. I just say. Animals in captivity, particularly souls and that kind of things, get all these neurotic behaviors because they're being stressed. They're being completely distressed out. In circuses, they have to do idiotic tricks to entertain humans. If I look to animals captured by humans in zoos, in this time kind of things, and in um, circuses in the streets, I always think on the Holocaust and slavery. There, we're the same cage. Yes. They are being the same oppressed, same way oppressed as we. If the woman being, if the man, if the black man being. Only then, even worse. In the time of the Holocaust, Jews, women have babies in their hands, and the Nazis ripped their babies away from them. In the time of the slavery, the men slave masters always think that they have the right to do anything with the, with the white, with the women slaves. The 
raped him also sometimes. Maakt er mee een paar Christians. Say that there be stupid and dirty, that there be nothing worse. And that's that. The servants. The break also the spirits of this uh, of this people. One of the saddest lessons of history is that we and we been bamboozled long enough. Re Rejected all efforts from the bamboozle. When you give a power, a charlatan power of you, you almost never get it back. And I want to help you. That's my mission here on YouTube. To awaken people from their path of corruption by the government, by all these cohorts and schismas that want so desperate hold you in captivity, want so desperate that they believe in what they are, make money for them. And I'll wake you and see the reality of what we believe in. And let you see that compassion is not a weakness, but actually one of the most strongest powers you can have. That you don't have to be ashamed of where you, how you've been, and that you don't have to be different. Or being a part of this society, or that you have to act exactly how the society wants you to live, to be a decent person. When darkness and light become one, the reality splinter away. And the truth become visible. Subscribe to my other social media. Look so also my other videos. You can watch my um, in this video discussed the topic of the political correct movement. You can also watch this video for me talking about my asexuality. You can also watch this video from my other channel where I make art. And I say you now. Go be What's the excuse for costing the least amount of money possible in this And let me find a bit of proud back in my speech. Instead of that, I have to be embarrassed. This is your chance to show the world exactly how kind and friendly you be. Why don't consume? and participate in a violent industry that's been based on bloodshed and, mer and malice, malice, the desire to hurt and destroy. It's the root of evil, actually. Just the uh, essence, just the part of evil. It's also a part of, yes. Compassion can only come 
Uh, morality can only come from compassion. From other other sorts, not morality. Malice can be used only when it only can be justifiable when it being to protect somebody else. Want you let that talk more about that on the topic?